Kevin from JJ Hat Center at 310 Fifth Avenue, New York City, between 31st and 32nd. That's by the Empire State Building. I'm just going to go through a few of my personal hats. Um, this is the San Sebastian. It's one of my newest hats. It's custom made in Spain. I took the lining out. That's about it. It's basically like my green one, but it's got a three inch brim. We still sell these. I think they're about $3.90. They come open town like this. So you can do all sorts of stuff, like if you want to do trace it or something like that. You could do is trace. Hi, Mom. I'm so cool. Anyway, we have this hat uh, for sale in like five colors. I think it's the San Sebastian. If you search for it, don't put in San Sebastian. Put in the San Sebastian. Okay. Great green color. Look at that. Your friend has green or blue eyes. Get this for him. And the gray color is amazing. The whiskey. Nice hat. It's my latest. Very soft. Beautiful quality. It's like so light. Okay. This is my second to newest hat. The Tri City. It's a flat brim. Three and three quarter inch brim. And I put a piece of ribbon on it. Metallic ribbon. Shredded the back. And a Chinese made uh, and a medallion. Looks like a Johnny Depp pirate cornball thing, I don't know, whatever. It was a gift. Van gave me that pirate thing, so I used it. It looks cool, I think. For felt. It also comes in like six colors. I think we only stock two colors. It might even be sold out now for Christmas. Maybe one or two left. They're coming in again, I'm sure of it. Custom made hat, Ivan, a Simon hat, with one, two, three, four colors in the binding. Two colors in the brim. This is aged, faded Panama here. Bolero. Okay. You know this one. So, what's your name? Do you know that there were two? This one has little holes in the crown. So this one doesn't. Two of them. These are very old. At least one of them is. I like to keep the tags on them. Not a custom hat made here at 310 Fifth. Van dyed, Van Ban. It's a custom made tie dyed. So we don't have anyone in with the mail department yet, but I'll just go with my shooting and head shots and I'll give you a call right when there's no one. Custom job here, you can basically get whatever you want, it's 450. It's one of my old hats, three inch brim. Yeah, yeah, what's that? It's like the untouchable, but this color, no, we have it in camel. Uh, black and a steel blue almost sold out. This is the same as my green hat A little more rare. I don't bust this out That often same as the green uh, I actually have three of those. Did you know they're crushable these hats too? I've rolled them a zillion times the greens are eh, They are crushable almost all my hats are except that big giant tri-city that is not crushable All oh, this one is probably all the lavender one Lavender hat. This was a special order. The favor of my guy from Borsalino. This was years, years ago. 20 years old. Borsalino one. Has some kind of special message. Special message on the sweatband. I can't really read that to you. It's kind of. Okay, you'd have to do a freeze frame to see it. What else do I got here? San Sebastian is, I think, my current favorite. And the green ones, of course. Yeah, I've got my motorcycle hat. This is a copy of the James Dean motorcycle hat. No, not James Dean, Marlon Brando, sorry. A wild, the wild one. He's got the handlebars here. Marlon Brando. You know the famous scene, right? Uh, supposedly it's the same French company that made the original hat. Maybe they'll chime in. They said they made it two exact vintage specs, like even the lining and everything is the same as Marlin's old hat. It's 
was a gift I got from my wife like 20 years ago, and she wore it like once, so I just took it back. Okay, I got more hats. I'll show you guys more soon. Peace.